Well, towing the camper out to deer camp. You can see it out the back window there. And uh, a little bit warm this afternoon, but the mornings will be cool. And time to set up the blinds and check the tree stands, put out the cameras, all that stuff. Check my shooting lanes. Basically a work weekend. Maybe Sunday morning I might do a little bow hunting. So uh, stay tuned. Looks like Dale got Gary's camper down here. Cool. Got to pull in. Well, finally got camp set up. Let me turn the camera around here. It's Gary's camper. I guess Dale took that down. I got mine set up. I actually moved it up a little higher. And I think when Gary gets down, he may want to pull it right up alongside or yeah, if he wants to, he could just leave it there. It's no biggie. But it makes more room for parking. But uh, anyhow, it was a little more level. Just pulling it up a little higher because there's a drop off right there. But yeah, got it hooked up. Got water filled up. Venting out the windows. Cleaned off the solar panels. Got the antenna set up. And I think I am going to set down for a minute. Oh. Beautiful evening, but it's a warm one. It's about 90 degrees out, but it's getting cooler down here in the bottom, so it should be nice. Of course, we won't have to turn heat on tonight. But uh, got everything set up, like I said. And drink some water here. Cool down a bit. Beautiful day. Nice clear skies. Uh... Got the camper straightened up. It got tossed around a little bit, pulling it out here. You know, things falling off benches. And I tried to secure everything, but you know how it goes. You, you tow a camper and a few things are going to get shuffled around in the mix. Um, anyhow, uh, I guess I'm going to set up some, some blinds in the morning. And I'll get, uh, uh, on the private land, I'll, I'll get a feeder set up at at one point and uh, check out my tree stands make sure the shooting lanes are clear that sort of thing pretty sure they are I did a good job last year so uh, that may not be too bad but uh, welcome to the channel if you're joining us new uh, please hit that subscribe button and uh, you know we're gonna do a hat giveaway at 300 subscribers or just a few, you know, handful of subscribers away from that. So uh, hit that subscribe button, and uh, we'll we'll see how the giveaway will go at 300. No charge to you. There's some scammers on YouTube that try to say you won something from a certain channel, and if it's a giveaway from this channel, there will be no charge, no fee, nothing. You know, uh, I'll ship it to you free of charge. So. Uh, you know, just be aware of that, because there's some unscrupulous people out there, believe me. Uh, I know Hooty Who had that on his channel. He had some scammer trying to make people believe they had won. I was one of them. Of course, I didn't fall through it for it. Didn't fall for it, and I let Adam know, Hooty Who. And uh, he put a word out about the scammers. Uh, shout out to Whitetail Warriors Deer Camp. Shout out to... Uh, friend outdoors uh they've been you know, tagging me back and forth on videos and really enjoy their videos as well friend outdoors and uh life of murphy outdoor channel uh family that uh records some activities fishing different outdoor activities uh check them out as well um Anyhow, us outdoor channels, especially us smaller ones, need to uh, get the word out for each other. So uh, 
check them out and stay tuned. I'm walking out to set up the main blind. Well, got the blind set up. Nice shaded area. Now to get the feeder and camera set up. Well, threw some piles of corn out and got the feeder set up. Of course, the camera and the blind. 458 Oki here, uh, sitting in a blind, just seeing what if anything shows up or not. Uh, anyhow, give you a view out the window here. Still pretty light out. Of course, the camera shows a lot more daylight than, than there actually is, because it's getting dark out now. But beautiful day. It's a great day to be in the woods. It was a little hot during the day, but I got a bunch of stuff set up. Feeder, uh, shooting lanes. Uh, took care of a lot of stuff, so I don't have to worry so much about it during rifle season. But Well, just for the heck of it, I'm sitting in a blind. Got the crossbow here with me. Um, just in case something walks through, I really don't want to shoot a deer with it this warm out, but you never know. The moment you don't take something with you, that's when the monster walks by, right? But uh, anyhow, uh, pretty much ready for muzzleloader season, so uh, I'm glad I got everything set up. Um, so stay tuned to the channel. Thanks for watching. Just unloaded the crossbow. And uh, we're shot in dim light. That's not bad. That's a dead deer right there. Cool. I'll get that out of there. Well, it's the final mor morning before I head back in. Uh, the Sunday of, I guess, opening weekend of uh, archery. But my main intent was to, I'm not in camouflage or anything, my main intent was to check my shooting range, set up my blinds, put out the cameras, uh, set up a feeder that's out here, clear shooting lanes, a lot of grunt work. And uh, so I got all that accomplished. So when muzzleloader season rolls around or if I come out on a weekend for some archery, when the weather's cooler, it's been in the low 90s out here. At night, it got down to the 50s, so perfect sleeping weather in the camper. Had the windows cracked and perfect sleeping weather. But uh, anyhow, uh, about to head back to the camper, uh, clean things up a little bit, and head back to town. And looking forward to hunting season. Now that everything's set up, I don't have to worry about the initial setup and everything. Uh... <laughs> that sounds kind of redundant, but it's kind of a peace of mind just after work, you know, go home, pack a few things, head out to deer camp and be ready for hunting. So uh, I'm glad about that. Let me uh, turn the camera around here. Um, as you can see, I got the, the feeder set up right there where the arrow's pointing at. You see that? And uh, off to the left, you can't see it from here, but I've got my game camera. So, uh, anyhow, it uh, feels good to have all this taken care of. And uh, check the nuts and bolts on my climbing stand, check the cables, you know, do all the safety checks. So, uh, feels good to have all that out of the way. You know, I, I can rest assured my equipment is safe and uh, everything's functional. Um, so anyhow, stay tuned and plan on having some more, uh, hopefully interesting <laughs> hunting videos. I always like to document, uh, deer season, whether it's setting up camp, setting up blinds, stuff like that. 
but uh, didn't really go into detail on footage on setting up the blind or anything. It's just a hub blind that uh, snaps out and it uh, just really um, is easy to set up. So there was no real challenge to that. So anyhow, uh, heard a deer blow a little bit ago uh, down in the bottom somewhere. That was pretty cool. But uh, anyhow, stay tuned to the Deer Hearse channel. And if you haven't done so already, subscribe. Hit that bell. The bell gets you notifications. Uh, sub subscribing is free, guys. And just tap that button and you're subscribed. And uh, <clears throat> um, if you hit that bell, you'll be informed of new videos. And if you hit that like button, if you like the video, <laughs> if you don't, don't hit the like button. But uh, it does help the channel. Uh, and commenting helps as well. So uh, thanks for watching and stay tuned.